Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to talk about Samsung's brand new One UI 8 beta program. The good news is, it's already here, and it's based on Android 16. And even better, Samsung launched it earlier than expected. Let's break down everything you need to know. First things first, what's going on? Samsung has officially started the One UI 8.0 beta program in South Korea. The first phones to get this beta are the Galaxy S25, S25 Plus, and S25 Ultra. If you live in South Korea and own one of these phones, you can join the program right now. But don't worry. If you're not in South Korea, Samsung usually rolls out beta updates to other countries like Germany, the UK, and the USA soon after. So if you're in one of those places, stay tuned because the update could arrive in your region shortly. The firmware version for this beta is S9X8NKSU3 Zire. And for Galaxy S25 Ultra users, the update size is around 3.3 GDB. The size might be slightly different depending on your device model. Along with new features, this beta also includes the May 2025 security patch to help keep your phone safe. Now, why is this early launch important? Well, let's go back to One UI 7. Last year, the update rollout was a mess. There were delays, confusing schedules, and frustrated users everywhere. People waited for months, and even when the update came, it had to be stopped and fixed multiple times. It was a rough experience. Samsung seems determined not to repeat those mistakes. Launching One UI 8 beta early shows that the company is serious about improving software updates and listening to user feedback. It's a positive move for Samsung users. So, what's new in One UI 8? Unlike One UI 7, which changed the look of the software a lot, One UI 8 focuses more on small improvements. There isn't a big visual redesign, but the update brings lots of little upgrades. That means better performance, smoother animations, faster response times, and improved battery management. The goal is to make your phone feel quicker and easier to use without changing everything. We don't have the full list of changes from Samsung yet, but early feedback says the system feels cleaner and snappier. Now, how do you join the beta program? If you have a Galaxy S25 phone and live in a supported country, here's what you need to do. Open the Samsung Members app from the Galaxy Store. Log in with your Samsung account. Look for the One UI 8 Beta Program banner on the home screen and tap it. Enroll your device. After signing up, go to Settings, Software Update, Download and Install. Follow the instructions on your screen. Your phone will restart once the installation is done. But remember, this is a beta version. That means it might have bugs or problems. Some apps may not work properly, and your phone might act strangely. So if you need your phone to be perfect, every day, you might want to wait for the stable release. But if you enjoy testing new features and helping improve the software, give it a try. Lastly, what's next? Samsung has said this is just the start. The company plans to release four to six beta versions for testing before the final One UI 8 update. The goal is to finish beta testing and launch the official stable version for all Galaxy devices by the end of 2025. Also, Samsung confirmed that the Galaxy Z Flip 7 and Galaxy Z Fold 7 will come with One UI 8 and Android 16 out of the box. And that's it for today. Are you planning to join the One UI 8 beta, or will you wait for the stable version? Let us know in the comments. If this video was helpful, hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on the bell icon so you don't miss future updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.